Flag shop in Maine spent the last year stitching up support for the people of Ukraine. Maine stitching specialties gained national attention for the Ukrainian flags that they started making at the beginning of the war. The owners say they've filled orders from people all over just looking to wave the Ukrainian flag. News Center Maine's Caroline LaCour checked back in with them one year later. We thought this war would be over long before this for sure. A somber realization as workers at the main stitching specialties in Skowhegan cross off a year on their calendars, sewing the Ukraine flag and helping Mainers and beyond show their support for those in the crossfires of a war. What started as a simple ask from a customer has snowballed into becoming a staple for the shop. So I googled it and I saw it and I said, yeah, I guess we could build that, make that. And he said, well, I'll take as big a one as you can make. After word got out, owner Bill Swain says the demand for the flag grew and grew, with some customers even sending the flags to their family members living in Ukraine. A portion of the proceeds from each is donated to World Central Kitchen to help feed refugees. After that, our sales went all over the country. I mean, we, we were getting some California, Oregon, Michigan, just, just everywhere. How many Ukrainian flags do you think you made of? Oh, heavens. It's thousands and thousands. Charlene Goodridge was one of the first to make the Ukrainian flags for the store. She says it's all a game of focus. Intricate. It's very intricate because you have stripes you have to put together. Intricate detail and care into every seam and a gesture of solidarity for folks millions of miles away. Very important to hang the Ukrainian flags because we need to support them. Here it is, we're still, we're still filling orders every day for Ukraine flags. In Skowhegan, Caroline LaCour, New Center, Maine.